Bitcoin has posted a sell signal on the one day time frame, which completes the bearish trifecta. Now this may sound scary and yes, we are likely to see drops, but as a trader, this means you are about to see a potential buy opportunity. Now we're going to take a look at the one day time frame, get a smaller micro look at the four hour time frame, and a macro look at the one week time frame to determine where Bitcoin is heading next. How's it going everyone? My name is Jake with Trade Confident and as of today we are 206 wins, zero losses in our membership trades over the last 16 months. Heads up to our members, we have three new potential trade setups for you to take a look at. You guys don't want to miss out on this. If you want some quick profit, take a look at the trade setups tab and check out those trades. Also, tomorrow we have a new future forecast coming up. This one posted July 16th, talked about the potential ends to the Bitcoin rally, which we're actively seeing play out now. We're also gonna be talking to you about whoever owns all coins right now will most likely be the future millionaires of this coming cycle. We love Bitcoin and Ethereum, don't get us wrong, but once you see this data, I think it'll convince you why Trade Confident has 80% of our portfolio allocated to altcoins. Do not miss the future forecast videos, guys. Do not miss the brand new trade setups. Before we begin the analysis, I want to talk to you about some crazy news that just came out. Breaking Ethereum ETFs to launch Tuesday, July 23rd. The SEC has finally gotten back to issuers today, asking them to return final S1s on Wednesday, including fees, and then request effectiveness on Monday after close for a Tuesday, July 23rd launch. This has provided no unforeseeable last minute issues, of course. Now, the last time we saw a crypto ETF release, we saw an insane drop in Bitcoin over a period of a week or two, and then the prices went absolutely insane. I'm talking a pump from the bottom to the absolute top of 91% in Bitcoin. Now, I'm not so optimistic that we're going to pump that much in Ethereum, but it is a possibility, and I do think the Ethereum ETF release will have significant impacts on the rest of the crypto market, so we need to watch out for some volatility. And I think that an analysis over multiple time frames is going to help us read that in terms of technical analysis for this next couple of weeks. Diving right in, you're looking at Bitcoin USD on the one day time frame, and we're trading with the TC top and bottom finder, price versus well money flow, and trades and favor indicators. In this analysis, we're going to be talking about the differences between time frames and showing you how it could affect the price. On the one day, we see highly bullish signals. We see a sell signal, we see price versus well money flow high, and we see trades in favor high. And as I told you in the intro, this combines to create the bullish trifecta. This is the opposite of what we're looking for when we want to buy. Every time you see this combination, you're seeing it moves down in price, and this is why we need to be really careful. While a drop can cause a lot of negative emotions, what we do at Trade Confident is view this as a buy opportunity. This is a great thing to see because it means you get to load up on discounted crypto very, very soon. As the price drops on the one day time frame, we want to see the opposite. We want to see whale money low, meaning that whales have oversold and are likely to buy back into the market. As soon as this green line moves back up, we're likely to see the price increase as well. Next, you want to see trades in favor drop into the long trade zone. And this means that downward momentum would have run out and it's likely to bounce to the upside. So if you get both of these at the same time, whales about to buy in, market momentum about to bounce to the upside, this is going to present a great opportunity. Lastly, if you get a buy signal, all three of these combine to create what's called the bullish trifecta, and this is actually the combination of signals that we use to enter every single one of our trades. And just to put our money where our mouth is, Trade Confident entered a bunch of money into the market when we got the strong buy, price versus well money flow low, and trades in favor low. Now this is the daily time frame. From here, we're going to head to the weekly and take a look at a larger time scale. This is where things get interesting because the weekly time frame is actually bullish. We see price versus well money flow low and trades in favor low, which, as I just showed you, is exactly when we try to enter the market. 
We're already seeing price moves up, and as long as this green line continues increasing, showing that whales are buying, we can expect a price move upwards. And on the weekly time frame, which is going to look for a month or two out, I think we could easily touch resistance at $71,000. Now keep in mind, once again, I'm not expecting this to play out immediately. It is going to see some volatility, especially with the Ethereum ETF releasing soon. So keep that in mind. $71,000 is a longer term prediction. Now, if we head to the much lower four hour time frame, this is what's likely to happen over the next day or two. Right now, we see price versus well money flow is oversold. Trades in favor is low with an 87% chance of a pump. And if we get a buy signal, this will create that bullish trifecta that we're looking for on the one day time frame. So the four hour is also bullish. On a smaller time scale, we need to look at smaller price moves as well. Well, money is still moving out of the market, so I wouldn't be surprised to touch structure support here at $62,470. Major structure support at that point, and if we bounce from there, it'll easily move back to resistance at $65,000. It's as easy as that. Smaller time frames look for smaller price movements. As we move up to the one day, we're going to see a little bit larger potential moves. We could see a drop in a higher high, or we could potentially drop as far down as structure support here on the buy zone for $58,400. That is the maximum drop that I'm looking for. If the price drops any lower than that, then there's strong potential to break the previous higher low, which would stop this uptrend. And I just don't think that whale traders are gonna let that happen. Bullish all the four hour means we may see it moves up very slightly over the next day or two. More bearish on the daily time frame tells me we could see larger drops over the next week or so. And the weekly time frame tells us that we should be seeing moves up overall through the rest of the month. This is how you're gonna read different time frames on Bitcoin and use them to your advantage to make sure you can maximize your profit. An ideal entry is when you see the four hour, one day and one week lining up all at the same time. And we just need to wait for a drop in Bitcoin on the daily and we need to wait for the bullish trifecta to post in order to see moves up on all three time frames. Now, all of this will be affected by the Ethereum ETF starting trading next Tuesday. We need to keep an eye out for this. There's gonna be a lot of volatility and it remains to be seen exactly how this may affect the market. But when Bitcoin had its ETF released way back here, we saw a drop in the market followed by one of the largest moves up we've seen in a very long time. We're not sure how exactly that's gonna play out for Ethereum, but we need to watch for it and we need to be ready for some crazy volatility. And of course, we're gonna keep you updated the best we can, but the best way to stay updated on a day-to-day -day basis is to have these indicators up on your charts at all times. These are the combination of signals and you saw on the four hour time frame, Bitcoin is looking really good. And as a little hint for our brand new trades, it's not the only one looking good on the four hour time frame. You wanna have these indicators on your charts so you are ready for the next move and potential buy opportunities in Bitcoin and the rest of the altcoins. Members are gonna get access to these indicators with their exclusive coupon codes for up to $550 off. And if you don't wanna search for these trades on your own, members, you can also use the trade setups tab for the trades we just called this morning. Get access to the future forecast videos, metrics across 40 coins, morning brew overview, and next week's inner circle live Zoom hangout. Links are in the description down below. Go ahead and scroll down, click more. Membership is the first link. Go ahead and click that and it'll bring you to our membership page. Full access, 65 a month, everything I just showed you and more is yours. Go ahead and click subscribe now. Follow the prompts and once you have your membership, head to the second link for our indicator page. Pro Indicator Pack is what you're looking for and members, your first $150 off can be found with the coupon code at this link. Once you have that, click Pro Indicator Pack. Go ahead and scroll down. Click I want this, throw in that membership code, fill in your information, click pay, and it's going to offer you the TC top and bottom finder for $400 off, giving you that full $550 discount. Go ahead and click add to cart, follow the prompts, and we're so excited to trade with you soon. And with that, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Remember, trade safe, trade confident, 
and I'll see you in tomorrow's future forecast video in our membership. Don't miss out.